For semi-auto pistols, it's safe to say that the caliber wars of yesteryear are over, and the undisputed victor is the 9mm. In most guns, and for most purposes, the 9mm offers the ideal combination of desirable traits – high capacity, good terminal performance, modest recoil, and, just as importantly, low cost. That's why the vast majority of guns you see in holsters and in gun shop display cases chamber 9mm. There's a veritable ocean of them out there. Though there are tons of good options to choose from, only a few can claim to be the very best. Today I'm talking about exactly that and bringing you my list of the very best 9mm pistols you can buy in 2024. A revived classic and a genuine blast from the past, if you need an amazingly accurate target pistol in 9mm, look no further than SIG's P210 target. The classic P210 is historically noteworthy in several regards. It is known for staying in service with the Swiss military for decades and being one of the most accurate fighting handguns on Earth, if not the most accurate. It is also, probably, the most expensive service pistol ever designed and adopted. Long considered a sort of holy grail gun for American shooters, if you could shell out the money and find one, P210 is the crown jewel in any gun collection. These classic single stacks have been hotly sought after and fought over for years. Thankfully, the SIG of today has been fit to start producing these guns once again with some modern refinements and do it right here in the USA. This P210 got a facelift too. The overall shape and contours of the gun are slightly different. The controls have been reshaped and resituated to be more familiar to American shooters. But perhaps the most notable change to that long and lean silhouette is the addition of a sweeping beaver tail to protect from the original P210's notorious tendency to bite. I know die-hard SIG purists and mill-serp traditionalists alike will certainly throw a fit at that, but I can tell you from hands-on experience that these guns are worthy inheritors of the P210 legacy. With a 5-inch, traditionally rifled barrel, micro-adjustable sights, delicately crisp single-action trigger, and a heft of 37 ounces, this 9mm pistol is a proper shooting iron. The slide-to-frame fit Barrel lockup and all other engagements are so tight and precise, it feels like you are handling a solid block of steel. Vault tight is a compliment that does not quite do this gun justice. Although not quite up to the peerless standard of its original European progenitor, the American P210 target will still routinely shoot 2 inch groups or smaller at 50 yards. If sheer precision is what you crave, SIG's P210 target is undoubtedly the 9mm for you. The best equipped and most user-friendly version of Beretta's flagship pistol, the M9A4, is the best DASA 9mm available to discerning shooters. It's hard to go wrong with a classic. But what's funny is when you look up and find your favorite gun has become a classic. Time marches on, and that's certainly the case for the Big B. Designed in 1975, first produced in 1976 and adopted by the United States Armed Forces as the M9 in 1985, this Italian stallion has been with us for a long time. Sometimes derided, often imitated, but never surpassed, the M9 family of pistols enjoys an excellent reputation for durability, longevity, and supremely sweet handling. All M9s are accurate pistols and, despite their size, quite easy to shoot with a little practice. But much of the world and certainly the military has moved beyond the DASA handgun. With the US military and most police agencies switching to simpler, cheaper striker-fired pistols, for a time it looked like the sun was setting on the M9. But that was not to be. This ultra-modernized, multi-tone tan M9 will be immediately familiar to users of the legacy pistols. It still has that sexy open top slide with the barrel on full display, and the hinged locking block action is still at its core. Other than that, this Beretta is all new. 
This G variant is decock only. You won't accidentally slip the safety back on when you are running the slide anymore. The circumference of the grip has also been shaved down and paired with ultra-thin, heavily textured vertex grip panels. This dramatically reduces the length of pull for shooters with smaller hands and affords better leverage over the trigger, generally. A threaded barrel is now standard, as is a Picatinny rail on the dust cover. Front and rear sights are, thankfully, dovetailed in and now simple to replace. And the M9A4 is also optics ready right from the factory, capable of mounting any MRDS with the installation of the appropriate plate. With all of these intelligent upgrades, the old warhorse is once again ready to run against the best modern 9mm. That's two big, burly steel framed guns on our list so far but I promise we have some modern polymer ones just ahead. If you are enjoying this video, go ahead and hit like and subscribe so you don't miss even a minute of more great handgun content. A tiny pistol suitable for concealed carry, the Springfield Armory Hellcat RDP sacrifices not even a bit of performance. One of the biggest surprise success stories to come out of Springfield Armory in recent years is the Hellcat RDP standing for Rapid Defense Package. This striker-fired Polymer 9 is lean, mean, and packed with upgrades usually seen on much bigger guns. Boasting an ample 11-shot capacity and measuring only 4 by 7 inches, the Hellcat provides the assurance of a high-capacity 9mm in a slim, small package. Its real claim to fame is the fact that it doesn't shoot like a typical subcompact 9. With a wonderful trigger, self-indexing compensator, and included shield SMSC red dot, what we've got is essentially a pocket race gun. Though some shooters snub Springfield Armory as being less than compared to other more prestigious handgun manufacturers in this space, they've really cracked the code in terms of performance and size. It's not perfect. I know some seasoned shooters that deride the gun's brisk recoil as a little buzzy but the compensator on the RDP more than makes up for that. For ultra-compact carryability and superb shootability, the Hellcat RDP is a 9mm you want. If an ultra-premium 9mm 1911 is what you want and cost is no object, the Firehawk by Nighthawk Custom is single-stack perfection. First opening their doors in 2004, Nighthawk Custom began with a simple guiding principle one that I'm delighted to say they have stuck with. One gun, one gunsmith. Each and every pistol is built from beginning to end by a single, supremely talented individual. For any manufacturer, this level of true commitment is virtually unheard of in the modern world. And I can tell you this, the moment you pick up any Nighthawk custom gun, you'll feel it. In so many ways, the Firehawk is a throwback a single stack 8 shot 9mm, this pistol is a sleeper. In appearance, it is a full size 1911. But look closely up front, and you'll notice, virtually indistinguishable from the slide itself, a bullnose single port comp. Under the hood, it utilizes a commander length spring and plug to maintain a standard cycling stroke for optimum reliability. If you look at the overall feature list, there isn't much else to talk about. The frame and mainspring housing are checkered as expected. It has a commonplace skeletonized hammer, solid trigger, and hiney sights. There's not even a rail on the dust cover. Aficionados, though, will notice the masterfully blended magwell and tasteful French border on both the slide and compensator. This Svelte 1911 is a tack driver, pure and simple. Every facet, from the weight of the reciprocating slide to the fitment of the bull barrel has been tirelessly perfected to maximize performance. This is the flattest shooting gun I have ever fired, and that is thanks to the superhuman attention to detail Nighthawk Custom demands of its world-class smiths. However, this is not a 9mm for anyone except those who demand masterful but understated craftsmanship. Among 9mm 1911s and single-stack 9s generally, the Firehawk is peerless. Just be sure to bring your checkbook. An ultra-modern and intelligently designed striker-fired pistol, 
Walter's PDP is currently the best all-around 9mm on the market. Since at least the turn of the millennium, we have endured a ceaseless two decades of striker-fired pistol rollouts. There have been so many, I can't even remember them all. Each manufacturer and each new iteration promised to be the Glock killer or to leave all other competitors in the dust. Here in 2024, I know just two things for sure in that regard. Glock is still with us and still cranking out pistols. And Walter has surged out of more than two decades of fading relevance to once again become a preeminent handgun manufacturer. We'll skip the history lesson and get right to the good part with the PDP. The PDP, or Performance Duty Pistol, combines modularity and the best in state-of-the-art engineering to produce a wicked shooting machine. Highly configurable, accurate, reliable, and tough, the PDP series guns are unique in that users can mix and match slides, barrels, and frames to build their own optimal handgun. There are three slide lengths and two different frame sizes, and Walter advertises compatibility with non-factory slides too. Want a longer barrel and slide for improved sighting and accuracy on a compact frame suitable for carry? You can do that, or come up with some other combination. The PDP is ready to go whichever way right out of the box. And as expected these days, the PDP is red dot ready. But perhaps more than any other pistol on the market, this one has been designed from the ground up to maximize shooter performance using a dot. With the PDP, you won't be searching frantically for the reticle. After just a little bit of practice, you'll be on target from the break thanks to a specially tailored ergonomics that naturally deliver the reticle to your sight line. The PDP also employs the Performance Duty Trigger System to provide an incredibly crisp, consistent, and repeatable trigger pull, making the most of its inherent accuracy. I must note that this trigger is free of the grittiness and hitching that striker-fired triggers are infamous for. If you want the best all-around striker-fired 9mm on the market, the PDP gets the nod hands down. That wraps up our list of the best 9mm pistols available in 2024. From the extraordinary refinement of the duty-grade Walter PDP, the subcompact performance of Springfield Hellcat RDP, and the singularly awesome Nighthawk Custom Firehawk, we've covered them all. The 9mm cartridge might be basic, but some of the guns chambering it are anything but. If you're going to go with a full-size handgun, would you roll with the Walter PDP or stick with the modernized Beretta M9A4? Hammer versus Striker. Let me know what you think in the comments. And don't forget to click like and hit that subscribe button to stay up to date with all the great gun content on All About Survival.